हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द चैनल सो हेयर वी आर डिस्कसिंग द क्वेश्चन मेक ऑल जीरो ऑन कोर्ट शेप सो द प्रॉब्लम स्टेट सेट यू हैव एन एरे ए ऑफ साइज एन यू वॉन्ट टू कन्वर्ट ऑल एलिमेंट्स ऑफ दिस एरे इन टू जीरो यू कैन डू टू टाइप्स ऑफ ऑपरेशन चूज एक्स एंड सेट ए आई इक्वल टू ए आई माइनस वन फॉर ऑल आई वन टू एक्स डैट इज डिक्रीमेंट प्रिफिक्स ऑफ लेंथ एक्स बाय वन नोट यू मस्ट नॉट परफॉर्म दिस टाइप ऑफ ऑपरेशन इफ देर एग्जिस्ट any index i in 1 to x such that ai equal to 0 since that element would become negative next operation is choose x 1 to n and set ax equal to 0 that is decrement a single element to 0 we need to find minimum number of total operation of either types to make the array a all zeros it can be shown that it is always possible to attain this in a finite number of operations in given constraint so we are given first with t number of test cases and there is n the size of array and a1 to an the elements of array now for each test case we need to output the minimum total number of operations we need to make array all zeros so in first one it is very direct that all the elements are 1 1 1 so if you take x equal to 3 so from first index to third index all elements are transformed to ai minus 1 and since all ai are 1 so in one operation itself it is done because if we choose any index from 1 to i 1 to x it is only one operation now going to the second one 1 to 1 in this also you can take 1 2 3 and then subtract ai minus 1 which gives 0 1 0 now only we have one number of operation this now only one is left here so we can remove one directly by deleting ax which gives us another operation this is another operation so total two operation now let's see the other examples so in case of 1 2 it would be 0 1 1 1 if we subtract 1 and it is the first operation now we need to we can't subtract 1 why because our range of i was from 1 to x so we can't remove all these by subtracting 1 hence we need to remove all of these so for this we need to apply second operation for this also and for this also so total three operations so first we have applied first type of operation and second we have applied three second type of operation so total four operation similarly for 1 1 2 now coming to 5335245211 when you take 53352451 so in first operation you subtract one it will become 422 41 3410 then in next one you can choose index till 1 because we do not want 0 so 31130230 and this becomes Zero zero. So 
you have applied one operation here and another operation here now again for this we apply the operation so it becomes 2 0 0 2 0 2 3 0 0 so it is another operation now for this two operations would be done and two would be removed but as it is a single element so it would be beneficial if we remove directly ax so here only one operation is needed so two is removed now how many elements are left one two three three more elements so three more second type of operation so here four second type of operations are done and total four plus three seven so our answer is seven and what our approach would be the approach is very simple first you need to count the numbers till where zero is not there so we count the numbers till the point where we do not find the zero so here till this point zero is not there till the end so we take all the numbers and subtract one from them now this one becomes zero so we will update the index till this index we will keep the array and subtract minus one from it so if we count from zero so zero one two three four five six seven our x was first eight when one was there now it became seven and when we subtract from this then we are left with three one one three zero two three zero zero at this point now you check till where zero is not found zero is found here so we take only this part because we need to start from first index we do not have any other option so we will start from zero index till three so from seven now first x was eight then seven now it is three so till third index from zero to three we move now we subtract minus one so two zero zero two and the rest number now we check where is zero coming so we are getting indexes zero itself x is zero so if x is equal to the first index we will break the loop and then count the numbers which are non-zero here now after breaking the loop count the numbers so here how many numbers are non-zero one two three four four numbers and how many x we applied one two and three so this three plus four non-zero numbers answer is seven so like this you can approach the question and hence you can get the answer i hope you all understand this solution Thanks for watching.